Hi sisters, here I am, Michal. I'm finally making the video that you asked for me. How to paint with fluid acrylics on crap. Okay. We'll start with what we need. We need canvas first, but don't use this canvas, the, the Chinese canvas that is thin and is wrapped with plastic usually and it's the cheapest kind. It doesn't absorb the fluid acrylics very well. And if you put the crackle paste, it will just drop off this. So it's better to use a, like a better canvas. I can make another video about different kinds of canvases in another video. The materials we need, um, crackle paste. I use golden crackle paste. Don't use the other gel mediums crackles because it doesn't do the same effect as this golden. And it doesn't have to be such a huge jar. I'm just very greedy. And the second thing is, it's heavy, <laughs> is soft gel medium, which we are going to use. It's almost like glue. And we're going to use it on top of, of, on top of the first layer. Then we need brushes, of course, different kinds of brushes. And I also have these tools that are rubbery and flexible. This is like kitchen tools for, for cake. And this is how I move the paint on top to get the paint um, flow and get into the cracks. I'm going to put the, the fiber, the crackle paste. So I'm going to put a thick layer where I want it to be uh, deep cracks and a thin layers um, if I want it to have really, really tiny cracks. So I like to put a lot. So I'm just, and so I'm not making it even. It's different, you know, different uh, spots on, on the canvas. And of course I can play with it and everything will be texture, texture, texture. But mostly thick and thin. Spread it thick and thin. This is the most important thing. So now you take some uh, gel medium and you can mix it with color. I mix it with some turquoise and I put some yellow ochre and white. And I want to make a layer that will seal the cracks. You don't have to do that, but I like to. I don't like the cracks to be so open. And it also, it's a good adhes adhesive, so it will keep it from falling apart. Here we have our dry surface. It, in the summer, it takes about an hour or two hours to dry, and in the winter, it can take a day or two. So I'm starting to put the, the gel on top of it, and the gel, is, the gel is transparent, so it will dry transparent, most, not transparent completely, but it will not be such this color, and the cracks will be filled with this yellow. Okay, so, and then I wait till it's done. It gives me a very glossy surface to paint on. And uh, I like the, the effects of transparent layers and glossy layers. You see how it gets into the cracks? And then I can, now I have, I have turquoise in the cracks. We can have some more here. I'm going to do it slower. You see what happens? You can see here that, that there were a very thick layer of crackle paste, so the cracks are very deep. So I'm taking some Pirol Red and I'm starting to move it in a thin layer. So you see it adds a beauty a beautiful shade to the green and the cracks are filled with this red so it gives a very very interesting uh, texture it's almost like a crocodile's back or something
okay, I can go and work on it forever, it's so much fun, but I need to wait for it to dry. But you could already see the cracks and what happens, and it's a lot of fun. And I'm really curious to see what you will do. So it would be nice uh, if you can upload it on Facebook, on the forum. And I really want to thank my sister, my friend, Fifi, or Puja. So, come, come, come. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Ha, ha, ha.